So we are here at a little Christmas tree farm. Uh, I think it's a little farm for a Christmas shoot. And I have some props. We're just getting ready. You think those pants are a little small for him? No, I think they're, I think they're just they're up. They're butt. just up, yeah. It's okay. Got my scarf. We're all ready. We're shooting kind of in those trees right there. Um, but I also have another Christmas hat, a blanket for us to sit on, and then I have this little like sign. So we'll see how this goes. I hope he does good. He's fed. And I had to wake him up from his nap, but hopefully he won't be cranky. All the leaves are falling. And I guess this is like a better time to do the Christmas shoot because it's not too cold, especially for kids. Um, and some of the trees are obviously grown, but at least we're not dealing with bad weather and it being freezing cold. I don't know how this will look, but... This looks cute. Our, where's our freaking sun? I can always gonna, do this too, but... Whatever you guys want to do! If you don't mind, I'm just going to scooch this into the shadow. Yeah, 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 go it's ahead. Not, um, I know, because now all the sun's peeking through. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like center, I just want to like lift. It's got the Christmas music playing and everything. I'm trying, man. No fake snow? No fake snow. Not this year. <laughs> change his hat. I don't know if it's too much going on. What do you think? I'm talking up to you. Let's see. Hi, Kaden. <laughs> Kaden. <laughs> oh, I don't know if that tastes good, babe. <laughs> All right, Ann, put it down, please. So we are home now. Um, I couldn't get much footage of us actually doing this shoot just because it was very quick and we were trying to get all the pictures in um in the time we had because it was just it was very quick it was like a mini shoot uh 15 minutes i actually think she shot like 30 families um today so it was very quick and we were trying to like work it out with kaden and make sure we could get all the shots we wanted so wish that we could have been able to include bella in this because i really wanted to do a nice family shoot but unfortunately my one friend who has done some of my other shoots, she did my maternity shoot and my other family shoot that we did before I had Kaden. Unfortunately, Bella will not be able to be here until I think like literally Christmas week. So there was just no way that we were able to fit in a Christmas shoot then. Um, you know, everyone is booking now and we're, I'm very late on it. Like this was pretty last minute. I think I booked it like a couple weeks ago, but um, yeah. So I was able to get in with her um, and, and she sold out pretty fast. So I was glad that I was able to get something done. I've also just been kind of regretting the fact that I never got a newborn shoot of Kaden. Um, I wish that I did because like I'll never be able to have those newborn photos of him. I mean, we have a ton of great pictures of Kaden when he was a newborn that we've taken ourselves, but I so, so wish that we got a newborn shoot. Um, it was just really pricey. It was so expensive and um, I just never ended up doing it. So anyway, um, I really wanted to get this done, but yes, I know a lot of people were asking on my Instagram. I did talk about this shoot on my Instagram, so a lot of people were asking like, oh, is Bella gonna be in it? Um, but unfortunately, she will not be here until December and I cannot book anything then. It's just so late. Uh, so it'll just have to be me Aunt and Kaden. Grayson could have been in it, but I felt like that would have just been a total disaster, especially with how fast everything was. I am sitting on the couch. I have such a headache and Anthony is out um, to the store and he's going to pick up food for us. We're actually going to be doing a game night tonight with some friends. And I think Kaden's about to go down for a nap. I just fed him lunch. It's like 2.40, so he is definitely due. I think he woke up at like like a little bit before 12 it was right before we left so he is definitely 
almost ready to go down. He's kind of getting cranky, but he's just playing in his little area. Are you getting into trouble, mister? Are you ready to go? Okay, you're gonna get this caught. Are you ready to go take a nap? Hi guys, so it is many days later. Um, I have been so busy this past week that I need to catch up on vlogging. Um, but I'm just doing some work upstairs. Kaden went down for a nap. And this whole past week I've been like super stressed. Just a lot going on and I wanted to update you. So we did get our pictures back from our little Christmas wintry shoot. So I'll try to show you guys a few pictures of that. If not, you will see it on Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, go ahead over and follow me. I'll have my link below or right here. It's just underscore Meg underscore Lee. Um, yeah, so I also had the idea of using one of the pictures of Caden from the shoot to put on his birthday card. Now, I don't know what we're gonna be doing for his birthday. It's probably gonna have to be a small gathering, which sucks because it's his first birthday and I'm like really sad about it. I just want it to be perfect and just have like all the family and friends. But we're gonna figure that out. I am gonna probably order his invitations like soon. I don't know how many I'm gonna order. But I really want to try to get some Christmas shopping done and his birthday shopping done. Just like decorations and everything because we are in like mid-November right now. And who knows how fast this next like month is going to go. But like Christmas is literally around the corner. I cannot believe that like... Wait, is Thanksgiving next week? Thanksgiving's next week. I can't believe it. Um actually did that Christmas shoot very early um, so that we would be able to get our pictures back in time to send out for Christmas cards. Um, I explained all of that earlier. But right now, so many things to update you guys on. This past week, I was getting things ready for my sister-in-law's bridal shower. I had it at my house. It was a quaint, nice little shower that we threw for her. Unfortunately, we couldn't have it at like a big place with a lot of people. So we just had a little something at my house and it turned out beautiful. I'm so happy with it, but it was a lot of stress and just having people at my house, um, you know, with everything going on and just having to like sanitize everything. It was just a lot. And now I am starting to plan Christmas and Caden's birthday. Bella's coming. Um, I'm currently in her room right now. I'm just sitting at my desk that I have in here to work on this printer and I'm completely out of ink. I'm trying to do something for my Young Living stuff, like print some holiday things and I have no ink. So I'm gonna have to go out later to get some. We're trying to figure out when Bella will be getting here. We just figured out the dates for that. Um, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to share this. Uh, but Bella's gonna be moving and she's gonna be moving closer to us Not to New Jersey, but she'll be moving closer and we are really 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 excited about it great news and Things are things are looking up so a lot less like travel and We will hopefully be able to see her a little bit more often. She will be going to like a whole new school and everything so it's gonna be a huge change so that's going on there's just so much that i have not really like updated you guys on you guys know about my parents new house if you haven't seen that vlog i will link it below but my parents are moving out of my childhood home and uh, if you if you haven't heard about all of that i tell you everything and you guys get to see their new house their new construction what it will look like i have a whole like house tour of that it is the model home, so it's not their house, but it's what it's gonna look like. So check it out if you haven't seen it. Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to get some work done today. I did some Instagram posts. Um, I did some like, like to know it stuff. I am trying to work on my Young Living stuff. I have honestly been so stressed and so anxious. I'll, I have to admit, like I am going back to the doctors actually um, for my blood pressure because it has not been good at all and I have some health concerns and stuff so I'm going to be going back to the doctor next week. Um, yeah, I'm just a little worried about like my anxiety and like where I should go from here. 
I don't think I want to go back on medication. Um, I've been trying to do more like natural things like with my oils, which have been helping a lot. But I just think everything that's going on in this country and in this world, just like with the virus and everything, it just nothing seems normal right now. And it's it's been getting to me. Um, I feel like my new norm is just staying at home all the time. And in the beginning, you know, now we're like, I don't even know, nine, ten months in to this like pandemic. It's getting better, but now New Jersey just um, mandated more restrictions. And I'm just so ready for things to go back to normal, guys. Like, for someone that struggles with anxiety and depression and being cooped up in your house all the time and not being able to go out and do normal things, like, it's really hard on my mental health. I'm trying to do things that will help me, focusing on my health, like, trying to exercise more and do things because I know that we're entering into the winter months, which means that it is like the depressed months. <laughs> um, what do they call it? Like the winter blues or whatever, where everyone gets depressed because you can't get out and do things. But because this has been going on for so long, it has definitely, um, it's been hard. And Anthony's been working, like he's out every day, but he works outside. So it'll probably slow down in the winter, but, but because I've been inside and we have not been doing much, I think we literally went out to dinner for like the second time in months the other night. Like, and that was it. Like we really have not done much at all. I don't know how it is everywhere else all over the country, but um, yeah, it's just, it's depressing. I think it's really affecting so many people, so I know I'm not alone. I think it's financially affecting people, but I also think mentally it is affecting people. Like, everyone's nervous about shutting down again. And a lot of businesses, like, a lot of us just, like, can't afford to do that. You know, we have to make money and, and support our families and be able to live and eat. And um, it's just so hard nothing's like great right now it's not good yeah so that's where i'm at i feel like i'm rambling at this point because i'm just like talking and talking and talking i want to share um a couple things with you guys i created now today i actually have to do another uh christmas list i've been gathering together our christmas lists for christmas um things for katie and bella but I did a like Christmas shopping for her. I did one for babies like between one to three years, I think. Um, so I put a ton of stuff on there and then I'm also gonna do like a gift guide Christmas shopping list for him. So I can give you guys some ideas, but there's a ton of great things on there. If you want, check it out. Um, not gonna lie. A lot of the things that are on the Christmas uh, list for her is some things that I actually want and also some of my favorite stuff that I have. So I thought I would help you guys out um, and do that. I can share actually a few things on my computer for you, like a little sneak peek for you guys to see. I cannot wait for Christmas. It's going to be Caden's first Christmas and Bella's going to be here. It's going to be so fun everyone's been asking about vlogsember i would love to do vlogsember i hope it works out i hope i'm able to do it um i i don't want to like completely commit to it and say like yes i'm going to be uploading every single day but i do want to do it and i'm going to try to do it so that is what i'm saying um here let me turn the camera around so you guys can see i'm going to show you just like a little sneak peek of one of the shopping lists so this is the Christmas shopping for her. I have one of my favorite sneakers on here, the um, Ultra Boost by Adidas. Um, this back massager is incredible. You need this. Uh, Barefoot Dreams blanket. I put some like vacuums on here because you know I would love a vacuum. Skincare fridge, some like cozy socks. This mirror is awesome. It like lights up. I have some like purses on here. This is my coffee machine, 
my Nespresso that everyone asks about. This hat I always wear. Um, some diffusers. Hair products. My like tripod for my phone. This is the perfume I wear every single day. Absolutely love it. Um, I have some like workout stuff. Gets Apple Watch, AirPods, both of my cameras that I use to vlog. Um, yeah, so you guys can check this out. I just linked a ton of things here. And then also in the Christmas shopping for baby, I linked a ton of ideas. And you guys gave me some great suggestions. I actually asked on Instagram and a ton of you gave me some really good ideas. So I shared some of those here as well. Check it out, I'm gonna be doing a gift guide for him as well, so. Update me from the future. I did make a Christmas shopping for him, so you guys can go check this out. A lot of great ideas on here. I am planning on getting Anthony some of uh, the things on here, and I am still adding, so check back, but I will have all of the links below to these uh, shopping list and go get whatever you can now. I have already started my shopping. This right here is a must. And I tried to put a variety of different things for like, I don't know, different types of men. So like outdoorsy stuff and funny things and um like some tech stuff, if any of your men are into like whiskey or wine, um, some massage things, shoes, like just a variety. So there you go. Okay, it is much later on. Caden woke up from his nap and my mom was here um, because they were doing some stuff at that, their house and she needed somewhere to work. So she came over here to have a Zoom call and get some stuff she needed to get done and then also pick up some things for uh, my brother and his wife because they're having twins. I shared that in one of the last vlogs. Hold on, let me look at the camera. So she was picking up a bunch of stuff um, that we are going to let them borrow, just like a bunch of uh, baby things that Kaden doesn't use anymore, like his bouncer, his swing. Um, his Dakotot, his Boppy, like all these things. She packed all that stuff in her car, she just left, and um, it is about 5.40. I'm feeding Caden dinner right now. Okay, you want more? He's just having little chicken nugget things and sweet potato fries, just something really simple. I had to go to Staples to pick up some things that I ordered, which I can show you guys for um, Young Living. I just want to put together, I need ink for my printer, but I also ordered some like postcards and stuff for people that sign up. And um, I wanted to get, I'm sorry baby, I wanted to get those. And I needed more ink for my printer because I um, want to do some like stickers and things for like roller bottles. And I just use regular like sticker paper for my printer um, and then I like cut them out myself really easy but that has pretty much been my day I've just been like working and trying to get things done we cleaned a little bit of the garage out once we like moved all of Caden's baby stuff and then also I really need to organize his closet because I cleared out a lot in his closet that he had in there that was overwhelming um, the space in there so definitely want to clear that out and do some organizing I have clothes that I got to wash for him that are like new stuff that I got for winter um, I think I shared that in one of my last vlogs. I was telling you guys that I did get some things for him. I don't know what he's going to wear for Thanksgiving. I don't know what he's going to wear for Christmas. Um, but I can show you some stuff that I picked up. I haven't really gone crazy with shopping. I just got some like necessities. I got a bunch of like new pants for him. Just really cute things from like Target and stuff because now he's fitting in like 12 and 18 month. Um, 18 month is definitely a little big. But 12 months, he's pretty much fitting in. Like, he's definitely growing out of 9 months stuff now that he's 10 months. He also had a little bit of some yogurt 
melts or yogurt drop things and he also had frozen fruit in his little where did that thing go did you throw it on the floor no it's right here he had some frozen mango i usually like to distract him with this while i'm cooking so that he has something to occupy him always does this with his arms i don't know what it means but we've been trying to teach him a little bit of sign language like we do like more and all done usually when i do all done i will try to take this tray away like this thing pops off and if i take it away and he freaks out then i kind of know that he wants more to eat <laughs> but um i just you know trying to teach him things we've been doing that for a while and I swear, sometimes I feel like he says, like, more. Pretty much been in his pajamas all day today. Um, I did not get him changed. to start dinner. Anthony just got home in time to say goodnight to Kaden. I guess it was a really long day. It's almost seven. Um, he's been going down a little bit earlier. He usually goes down around 7.30, but because of the time change, he's just been going down earlier. He just gets tired. I'm gonna start dinner. Um, I'm making a HelloFresh meal because we I've had them in our fridge and I just got a new box this week. So I'm like, all right, we really need to make some. If you guys are wondering, I still do love HelloFresh. No, this is not sponsored. They have sponsored me in the past and I still love them. We still use them. And I pick and choose like which weeks I wanna do. I actually forgot to cancel this week. So the meals that came are not what I picked. But um, I was in between this ravioli because I didn't defrost any meat, but I was in between uh, this or this risotto and anthony picked the ravioli so this is what i'm gonna make it's really quick close your eyes get some rest Side. Lay your head on my 